Hi guys, this is B and A. We are back with a new video for you today. So we have been going on toy hunts and we have been looking for the Pick Me Pop surprise, um, both the smalls and the mediums of the series three. Um, and these are called the style series. So we've got um, five new ones to open up here. I'm pretty sure that we have got some new ones that we don't have. Um, and I'm pretty sure that we've got um, some of the ultra rare rainbows. So we've already got one. I think I got another one that's got one in it, hopefully. Maybe two even. Um, so if you've never seen our videos, we like to give tips and tricks on how to get the ones of these you want. Um, if you've ever bought these, they're kind of expensive. So the mediums around here are $10.99. Um, the smalls are $4.99. Mediums contain two, the smalls contain one. Um, if you're trying to get the whole collection or get something that you really like, you're going to be spending a ton of money if you're just randomly buying these because um, there is a lot, a lot to get total. I haven't actually counted up how many they have between the singles, um, the mediums, the jumbos, and then the um, new um, mega packs that they made, but it's a lot. So, um, we're going to give you some tips on how to figure out which what you're getting. Um, hopefully, um, with practice, you can get good at this also and then get the ones you would like. So, um, get going by telling you what we do. Um, when we go to the store, I take this list with us. Um, my phone actually just has a little slide-out compartment that holds like your ID and debit card, and I stick these in there. So, just in case we find some, um, I have what I have available and then which ones we've gotten. So these are always with me. If you're going to do this, I suggest you take that too because you're not going to have very good luck without this. Um, so this will tell you all the scents, everybody that's available, um, what they look like, and then what their scent is. So you're definitely going to want this if you're doing this. Um, and then the two things that you can do to try to figure these out um, is first by smelling it there are little holes and slats there um, that you are able to smell the scent um, I have to say this series though has gotten a little bit harder they added scents and they added scents that aren't um, real clear so when you are trying to figure them out you know like for instance there's a fr fruity gelato to know what that's gonna smell like um, without having smelled it before it's going to be really hard um, again summer berries so that's like a mixture of berries there's a blueberry bubblegum um, all of those are kind of tricky so um, the first thing you want to do is smell it and then you want to try to look through here so if you get lucky and it's laying well through the white here a lot of times you can kind of see colors and you can see patterns so a lot of these guys have patterns on them um, so those are the two main things that you have to do and then this just takes time so you have to be not afraid to sit there in the store and kind of feel silly um, smelling and looking at these so we do it we spend a lot of time um, we actually just went to the Walmart and they had two full packages of the mediums and two full packages of the small so that takes a while to um, look out but we had some good luck hopefully out of the ones that we found so that's the way you want it. You want to find it when they've got full sets there um, so you have plenty to look at. So um, we'll start out with this one here. So first going to give it a smell. Um, I'll tell you what I think and then B can say what she thinks. This is one of the, just, this is one of the trickier smells. Um, this one I think is the frosted donut. Um, to me I think the frosted donut smells like um, like a vanilla frosting candle. So like if you've ever smelled like a vanilla candle or vanilla like cupcake candle, um, that's kind of what I think it smells like. So I kind of go for the vanilla frosting smell. Um, so I've gotten kind of used to this smell, but at first I had a really hard time um, figuring out what this scent would be. So um, that is what I'm thinking the scent is. I'm going to give a look here and see what we see in it to see if we can help figure out um, who it would be. Okay, so if you're looking at your list and you think you smell a certain smell, so I said the Frosted Donut, um, the options are going to be Webbs the Spider here, um, Vampy the Bat, Leaps the Frog. So those are the only three um, that are the Frosted Donut scent. Um, one thing I noticed was kind of weird with this is usually in these packs you get two of the same scent. Um, so between this, there's three that are the same scent. So I'm not sure how that would play out. Um, 
So if you're looking for one, you know, one out of the three that you don't have yet, it's going to be hard to know if you're going to just get a duplicate or you're going to get one you don't have. But, um, so that's what I think fits with the scent. And looking in here, you're not going to be able to see on camera, but there is um, a pattern that looks kind of like uh, a splat of paint. So like if you saw um, like a graphic art that looked like a splash of paint, that's exactly what it looks like. So again, if you look back on here, this Vampy the Bat um, looks exactly like he has splashes of paint on him. Webs the Spider is sort of similar. Um, so that they're more together, kind of puzzly looking almost. Um, so this, let me believe this, pretty sure this is Vampy the Bat, um, which we really hope it is. Those are, or he is one that we really want. Um, B has wanted really bad. So hopefully it is, and he is one of the Rainbow Ultra Rares. So he would either come with then Webs the Spider or another Ultra Rare, um, Leaves the Frog. So we'll see who we've got going on. lollipop container and it is vampy the bat so this is what i was talking about you can see this splat through the package um because we got lucky of how it was sitting on there um i can smell it really strongly now that it's open they smell really good so once you um start smelling these this smells just like like a vanilla cupcake or vanilla cake um candle so that that's what really jumps to my mind and these do smell really really good Okay, so here's the other one that came with it. So I'm just going to use our, our tricks here to see who we think this is now that we can look at it. Um, right away here, I can tell that it's got like quite a bit of yellow on it. Um, I'm going to guess, just based off the other two that have this scent, Webs the Spider has a very distinct pattern. Um, what I can see on this is a lot more yellow. So I'm going to guess this is probably Leaps of Frog. Um with the rainbow. Um, if you haven't seen the rainbows, they kind of have an ombre change in their color. Um, so I'm going to guess this is who is this is, which would be awesome because that would be two rainbow ultra rares. And it definitely is. So that is Leaps the Frog. So this is what I was seeing in the package, which is a bunch of yellow there. Um, so see how it kind of changes kind of an ombre color. Um, he's the frosting also. It smells really good. This is really cute. The little patterns on its feet. That's really cute. Um, so if you were looking at these, and you sometimes you can see their faces through there. This guy has a little tongue sticking out. Um, that could help you if you're looking for this in the future. Um, and we have noticed with some of these that have kind of the change in color that they can look quite different. So if you're getting one, it could have much more yellow on it, and yellows and pinks in the front of him. Um, so definitely don't write this one off. I mean, if you look at the picture, you're only seeing kind of the pink the pink, orange, and yellow. And he's got a lot of blue and purple and pink also. So keep that in mind if you're looking for this guy. It smells really good in here now we've got that open. So let's see what other goodies we got. Got a little container. A little clip on. sure oh they're like little sticky tabs we haven't gotten any of these these are really cute so like using to like keep a tab on a page or bookmark or something like that those are super cute i hope we get more of these i might want to use some also those are really cute and then this is all the little stuff that comes with them so the little list um these come with clips now. So the style surprise come with little clips that you can clip your critters onto stuff. Um, so it kind of shows you here. Like you can hook them to like your sleeve. It shows a hat, um, a notebook, stuff like that. So that's something new this time. Got little stickers. And then here are the little cards. So we got Vampy the Bat, Batty About You, and then Leaps the Frog. You always make me hoppy. Super excited that we got those. Like I said, um, that's really awesome to get two of the ultra rares in one pack. I don't know how that plays out. So one thing I'm thinking when we were at the store, I didn't buy it because I thought 
probably two pack we'd already gotten had the spider in it. I was thinking it was more likely we got the bat and the spider together. Um, we might have to back and grab that so we get the spider and then see who he ends up with. Um, he would obviously have to end up with another one of the ultra rares. If that's the case, maybe we'll do a giveaway or something fun with those. Okay, so we're going to do another one. Okay, so first off, I'm going to give it a smell. And that's kind of a trickier smell also. Um, once you get used to it, you'll be able to pick it out a little bit better. Um, but I'm thinking that it's the marshmallow smell. Um, and the marshmallow only has two options. So um, it would be Grace the Swan and Snacks the, the Playing Cat. Um, and if you look at this carefully, you can see that the Pick Me Pop is largely white, um, which would fit with the cat. Um, but I can, right here, I don't know if you can see that in camera, you can see like a really distinct like pink um, like oval pattern. And if you look carefully, you can see some others over here. It's almost confetti looking. Um, and that would fit exactly with Snacks the Playing Cat. So that's who I'm pretty sure we've gotten. And then he would come with Grace the Swan. And Grace the Swan actually... Um, has that same pattern in there. So, see the little ovals on him? You can't always go exactly by his picture, so they look a little bit different because um, they're cartoons of them, but um, I'm pretty sure that's who we've got in this set. So let's open it up and see who we got. And that is Grace the Swan. So it says this is a swan. It looks kind of an owl-like to me. Um, and it does have some bigger patterns there. It almost looks like a little fruit pattern. Um, that I didn't see through package. But these little spots are what I could see um, and tell that it was largely white. Um, so give it a smell and see if it smells good. It smells really good. Yeah, so this does smell really good. Um, again, the marshmallow is a little tricky. Um, I think picking out that scent is kind of a harder one. Um, it, I mean, it almost kind of has the same as the frosting kind of smell. So, again, this just takes practice. So, you got to do both, you know, the looking at them um, and smelling them to try to figure them out. So, there's that one. And we'll see which other one we got with him. So that is Snacks the Playing Cat. So um, that's exactly who we thought we had. So again, kind of has a circle confetti um, and largely white looking. Um, and those were the only two of that scent. So there's that guy. Both of those are rares also. So that's cool that you got two rares in the same package. They don't often do that. So we'll see what other goodies we got with them. little ring little clip on oh those are stickers little, little puffy stickers they're like nice and thick I haven't seen those yet either so that's cute So there's a list of all the stuff. So there's another little pack of stickers in there. Here's their cards. Grace the Swan. You are the Swan for me. And Snacks the Playing Cat. You're the Cat's Pajamas. Grab another one. Okay. So this one caught my attention right away. Um, if you look through here, it looks yellow. All I can see is a bunch of yellow. Um, so that was really helpful for this one. Um, right away, without even smelling it, if I look at this list, um, Pips the Chick is all yellow. So, I mean, nobody else is even close on having a lot of yellow on them like this. So I right away was sure that this is who this is. Um, give it a smell anyway. It does definitely have like the fruity pineapple smell. So the options for who could be with him, so definitely Pips the Chick, would be Puzzle the Dalmatian, uh, 
The only other option is the flashy supersets. These are both pineapple, um, but the flat the supersets come together. So I'm gonna say that those are out. So this is most likely um, Pips the Chick and Puzzle the Dalmatian. And that is Pips the Chick. I'll give it a smell. It does smell really good. Um, it's kind of like a pina colada smell. Is what kind of what I think it smells like, but very cute and fuzzy. And we'll see who we got with him. I'm just looking through the package to see if we could figure this out. Um, this looks pink to me. It looks pink with spots, so I'm going to say that definitely would fit what puzzled the Dalmatian. So if you're looking for these and you see um, um, you're seeing this guy on top, it looks pink with a lot of blue spots. Yep, so that would be puzzled the Dalmatian. So he does have a lot of, he's pink and then has like purple and blue, uh, orange, yellow on him. Um, if you haven't seen these before, these are the style um, straps that came with, so you can wear them on your finger, hook them on the sun with stuff, um, really cute. So he's pineapple also. Um, both of those are commons, but who really cares if it's common or not, they're cute anyway. We're gonna open up the special stuff we got with, them. Um, little case, a little seal, that's cute. Is a mini pen. These are really cute. These would be cute for moms to stick in their purses. Also, would have a little mini pen. A little clip on. Then here's the pouch with the list and everything in them. Got stickers. Here's their cards. Pip the Chick, Peek a Boo, and Puzzle the Dalmatian. You're so bow wow. Alrighty, let's do another. This one. I'm not seeing a whole lot through right off the hand, so I'm gonna give it a smell. Okay, so this one you can't see a whole lot except you see quite a bit of white on them. Um, and the smell is kind of a trickier smell. It's not real strong that I can smell. Um, I got this one though because it looked um, pretty white. So just looking off my list and just trying to rule out what I would for sure it wasn't. Um, something that was white was Mitsu the Koi, and that's one that we want really bad. Um, so, this has a faint smell. It kind of smells coconutty to me. If um, When you can smell this really well, I think it kind of has like a sunscreen smell, like the coconut, you know, sunscreen smells good like that. So, um, my guess was this is who it was. I'm not extremely confident on this one, um, but just kind of ruling them out, I'm hoping that's who this is. So, while she opens that, some of the options to go with him could be Ferb the Anglerfish, um, Sheba the Sheba Inu. So, we do have both of those. Um, I can't remember if we got that in the two-pack or if that came in the one of the mega packs. Um, but we do have those. Star of the Seal is um, Coconut. And that's it. So, those four are the coconut options. Um, I'm hoping for these because we don't have them. Okay. So, we'll see who it is. Awesome! So, this is Mitsu the Koi. Um, that's a common, but it was one we wanted really bad. We're fish people. We have koi fish, actually. Um, so this is one we really, really, really wanted. So, um, if you're looking through for him in the package, if it's laying right, you could have luck seeing a lot of white, but seeing these really distinct, um, circles on him, um, could be really helpful depending how it's laying. So, that's a good tip for that one if you're looking for him. So, let's see who we got with it.
That one is Sheba the Sheba Inu. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Do we have that one? I was thinking we had that one, but now I'm looking at it. I'm thinking maybe we don't. Maybe we don't have that one. Um... That one is a common also, but really cute. Um, this one has a really distinct pattern, so if you're seeing this one on top, um, looking for the the triangle pattern could be really helpful with that one. We'll open up the little special packs and see what there are. Little case. Oh, it's Fampy. That's cute. Another little clip. We have a lot of those clips now. We're going to have to figure out something to do with them. Little pen. And then there's all the little goodies. So here are their cards. I think it's Mizu, the Koi, your fin to be with. And Sheba, a round of a pause. A round of a pause. Some of those are kind of tongue twisters. And then little stickers of them. Okay, let's open another. Okay, so this one right away um, also looks like I can see quite a bit of white. Um, this is one that I was able to pick out regular quickly also because there aren't many that are white. And we just opened one. And so it's not, I'm pretty sure it's not the same as that. Um, I gave it a quick smell. This one has like a really strong smell to it. Um, it's kind of one of the tricky ones that is harder to pick out. But I'm pretty sure um, that it's the blueberry bubblegum. It doesn't smell bubblegummy to me, but it does have kind of the blueberry scent. Um... And was seeing quite a bit of white, and you can actually see a little bit of like a yellow triangle almost. I'm pretty sure this is probably Feather the Bald Eagle. Um, and then the option to go with him for the same scent is Peta the Puppy. So I wanted to mention real quick, while they have added more scents to these, um, if you can see right there, there's a ton of them. The one thing that is nice is there's not a whole lot of sets that have the same scent. So these are the only two that have that scent. So if you're pretty sure that's the scent, you're pretty sure that's who you're getting so that's kind of nice um there's like two like the coconut there are four different guys so two sets that you could get with those um same thing with the apple but it's pretty nice that some of them are limited so that does kind of help And that is right. It is Feathered the Bald Eagle. So there's a lot of the white you can see. I couldn't tell the blue from how it was in the package, but the little kind of triangle sh shape of the um, yellow definitely helped. Okay, and then it's the blueberry smell. So we're going to give it a smell now that it's open. It is a lot stronger once it's open. It does definitely smell like blueberry to me. Um, I don't get the bubblegum out of it, but um, anyway, it does smell really good. So we'll see who else we got. Well, we pretty much know who it is going to be with them. Um, yep, so that's Peta the puppy. That was the other blueberry bubblegum scent. Um, if you see this one on top, he would look pink with a, the dark circles are really distinguishable. Um, so that might help if this one were sitting on top of the package. Um, so keep that in mind also. And then both of these guys are rares. I'm going to open up the little goodie bags that came with it. Oh, we got more puffy stickers. That's really cute. It's on one of the rainbow ultra rares. That's Ducky. Sorry if you can hear that in the background, our cat is meowing like super loud right now, so she's kind of photo bombing us, video bombing us. Little ring there. A little clip on. And then here's the bag with all the stuff that comes with it. Here's the list. There's Feather the Bald Eagle. You've got an eagle eye, and Peta the puppy, 
You're so popular. Alrighty, so we do have one more to open here, um, but you're, I'm going to put this in a separate video, so I will link that at the end of this, um, and I'll tell you why, because I'm pretty sure that we finally found a super set. So, I'm going to save this one for another video. You're going to have to watch to check that one out, because um, that one's got its own kind of set of tips um, that I want to give. So, there's all the good guys that we got today. We got really good sets. Um, we got who we thought we were getting, um, so that was awesome. I think we'll probably run back to the store and try to get the one that had the spider in it. Um, it smells really good in here now that we've got these all open. But um, thanks for watching. If you use these tips and tricks, I hope they can help you out to figure out who you want. Whether you're trying to get all of them or you just have a certain one that you really like. Um, hit that subscribe. Check out other videos. I'll link the video for this one at the end. Um, and we'll have another video coming up soon of the individuals that we bought. And we also found season one um two packs which we have never found so stay tuned for that also thanks for watching hit that subscribe overload it's a cute overload don't you want to take us home cute 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 overload